It's official now. The high hustle podcast about to sit you down. Go and fix your crown. This ain't a grain of salt. Yo, what's good? It's your boy Mafioso. Hive Hustle Podcast with my bro Elijah, King Savage. Yes, sir. We ain't going to call him Savage much longer <laughs> anymore, though. Like, that's just not what we want to be representing. Yeah, I'm just joking. Not, probably not too much. <laughs> yeah. I remember I talked to you about that way back in the day when we was in SWA together. I'm yes, like, bro, sir. Savage? <laughs> like, come on, man. But no, this is the, a part of the episode where we get a little deep and we want to get to know you as a human. For outside sure. of the art, outside of the craft. For sure. For you know what sure. I'm saying? Like, you're younger, so mm-hmm. you grew up in the 2000s. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So you guys in your generation deal with trauma, deal with triggers, mm-hmm. deal with emotional things differently. Exactly. So what helps you? Obviously, we know roller skating. If you want to go to a park and you having a bad day, we know that. Right. But what other things do you have in your life that you feel like help you through your dark days? Um, It'd be music, really. Um, video games. Yes, I'm young. But what video, what games, video games, games do you play? <laughs> um, I be playing Call of Duty. Uh, some most of the car games I like really soothing. Forza, shit like that. Crew, you know, car cool. games are crazy. Yeah. Um, COD. You know, you'll see me probably playing GTA with my friends, talking shit, whatever. <laughs> but um, besides the games, music, scooter riding. Okay, that's definitely another outlet. It's Using being energetic, you know, I feel like that's a lot of us when it comes to creativity. Like we have to our mind has to be moving. Yeah. When we get still, it's like we think about Mm -hmm. it. And a lot of the times how we get through it is just staying moving. What I will say is rest is important, though. That balance of rest is very important. Uh, Trust me, I've been (laughs) I've been getting burnt out this past couple of weeks. (laughs) Really? (laughs) It happens, man. You got to rest. Yeah, no. That's why low key. I haven't been at the rink a lot. Because I've just been like, you know what? Let me focus on my family. Let me Facts. focus on my mental health. Facts. Like, people don't understand that your social window and your energy is taken all day. Oh, yeah, for sure. You coming here and having this conversation with me is taking your energy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I only got like a social window that's like this big. <laughs> that's why you. St- I don't talk to nobody at the rink. Yeah. People oh, yeah. get I, mad at I me, like you. legitimately mad at me. Just like, be, bro, just well, be skating. Like, <laughs> I just be going. Just I be will skating. literally nod at you. And, and go <laughs> like I, why I'm there for therapy. I don't need to talk to nobody. And then not only that, half of the time I can't even see the person because I'm going so fast. And most of the time, I don't, I'm not calling nobody out. But most of the time, when y'all be conversating, y'all be trying to conversate for like ever, like, like 15, 20 minutes. Bro. And I'm like, yo, we only got three I hours. Hear my song come on. If you see me like nudge away from you, just oh yeah, we all right we go, <laughs> we go. Like I heard my song, it's over with. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> now, what would you give some advice to like new skaters that are trying to come into the scene? Um, my, my best advice to y'all is stay true to something that you guys would like to do. I mean, I, obviously you're going to see people do things, you know what I'm saying? You might want to do it, but just stay true to you. You're going, you know, if you want to do something, don't let anyone else be like, Hey, like, I think you should do it this way or whatever. Like, yeah, just stay true to you, you know, keep your head down. It's always going to be those ego chasers out there. Just, Oh, I'm better than you. This, this, just keep your head down. Keep grinding that grind. That hard work is going to pay off. Trust. Trust That's me. good. That's good. Look, man, he young, but he got some knowledge, <laughs> some nuggets, man. Well, I will say this, bro. Um, this is also the type of podcast where I'm able to gas people up that right. like I've watched grow. Mm-hmm. And over the past, I think I met you in 2018, man. It's 2024 now. So it's been about six years. Mm-hmm. Like over the past six years, I've seen you grow tremendously. I've seen you get in your trouble. <laughs> I've seen you have your falls. I've seen you get it back up. As a big bro and as somebody that inspires you, if I could tell you anything, is consistency breeds greatness. For sure, yeah. Like, remember that always. Like, I seen a meme today where it was like emotional flame was going up. Mm-hmm. And then there was a consistent flame. Mm. And it was like consistency, emotion. Like, don't let your emotions run rampant. Don't let them run your life. Realize that feelings aren't facts. Facts. And you just, you got to... Grind past where you feel comfortable. Literally. I know you lazy, <laughs> but you got to grind past it's, where you feel look, comfortable. You got to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. I know that. There you go. Very bad See, experience. look, he giving y'all nuggets, man. Look. But look, I'm not a fan of like 45 million minute podcasts. <laughs> um, I get in, get out, get quick. Now, 
obviously we know you're somewhat of a skate influencer. Like people look up to you, bro. You could you could deny it all I you was want. Say, mm. But there's people out there at the rink that look at you and be like, Yeah, that guy, Elijah, Mr. Savage himself, <laughs> like he's crazy. So what do you have going on that you could tell us about that maybe we could look forward to seeing? Um, I got a lot more traveling going on. Really? Yeah, a lot more traveling with the so of for some of y'all who don't know, I have I have kept it a little low key and haven't like said anything too much about it. But yes, I've joined uh in mob we trust from California. Yeah, I didn't even know, mm-hmm. and I'm seeing videos of you, and I'm like, yo, when did you get a new crew? Because yeah. I was still under the impression you was SWA. Yeah, so for this, it's been probably about a month now. Okay, probably a little longer if I'm gonna, you know, just thinking in my head, I'm gonna say it's been it's been not too long, but it's been a pretty minute. Uh-huh. Um. Our our skate team's pretty cool. We do we do a lot of good things. We're sponsored by uh um Roller Skates of America out there. Okay. So with that we do uh parties and events. You can call us and we'll put wood in your backyard and you guys can have rentals and you guys can have a whole skate party in your backyard. That's dope. And we'll do it for you. That's dope. Um other than that, I mean traveling, school. What do you feel about this figure skating fair that's coming out to Vegas? Um Are you looking forward to it? Yeah. It's not gonna be as as much as y'all think like skate affair is, I mean, it's definitely gonna put Vegas on a map. I don't see everyone coming out here like they always do. Yeah. But I mean, it's definitely gonna put Vegas on a map. But I mean, I don't have my my hopes high for this. I'm not gonna. Okay. Lie. Well, hey, I was I was hoping high. So, but if you saying that, I'm I'm gonna just be ready for whatever comes. That's, that's all it was. I'm, I'm just being ready for it. You know. I okay. Mean, well, I, I'm sure they got some sure they got some smoke coming, but I mean. If it's enough to put Vegas on a map, then cool. But that's all I care yeah. about. Like we haven't had a skate event come here. Right. Like, we've thrown a couple, but we haven't had one come here. So that's yeah, dope no. that that's happening. <clears throat> well, this has been another episode of the Hive Hustle. We appreciate y'all for tuning in. This is my boy Elijah, my boy G Suede on the ones and twos. Um, we appreciate y'all. Thank you for tuning in all the time. Thank you for watching the reels. Thank you for following the accounts. Keep doing it. Keep supporting, and we'll see y'all next time. Peace. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of the High Hustle Podcast. Do me a favor, like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Also, follow our partner, Swarm Branding. We'll see y'all next time.